A convenience store manager is under arrest, charged with sexual battery on a female police officer. And as Fox 5's Doug Evans reports now, Hogansville police say that the officer was in uniform and on duty at the time. The Hogansville police chief tells me that his young officer went inside this convenience store here to perform a business check. That is to simply get out of the car, go inside a business and interact with the employees. He says it appears that the manager waited until the store was empty and then he surprised her from behind. Uh, reaches across the counter from around and before she catches her by surprise, before she's able to react, he grabs her, snatches her behind the counter, basically off of her feet up into his arms and then attempts to perform a lewd act on her. Hogansville police say the sexual battery happened at the Hop-In convenience store. That's just off Interstate 85. It happened, they said, on May 11th. They say according to the investigation, store manager Prilesh Tucker attempted to forcefully commit, quote, an indecent act on an on-duty female police officer. According to the department, the officer reacted, separating herself from the assailant and reported the incident immediately to her supervisors. But to do this to a police officer on duty in uniform, uh, it's a very bold act. Uh, what could have happened had she not, not gotten away from him, I, I would hate to imagine. Police say Prilesh Tucker was taken into custody that very same day. He's charged with sexual battery and obstruction. He was booked into the Troop County Jail. Anyone that had any information or has had any other kinds of dealings with this, this man at this store or any other place that he's worked to please contact us because we feel like if he will do that to a police officer, he's done this before. The chief tells me that he has heard from the company. They were extremely apologetic. They say they have fired the manager and they are cooperating in the investigation. In Hogansville, Doug Evans, Fox 5 News.